Welcome to Baby Wawa TV. It's reading time, boys and girls. And this book today is entitled Lily Brown's Paintings. And the author is Angela Johnson. And the illustrator is E.B. Lewis. And that's Lily right there. And she's doing what? She's painting. Lily Brown loves her mama, daddy, and baby brother and the world they live in. That's her and her family. Sometimes she spins around her room thinking about their world and it's wondrous. That's her spinning in her room. But when Lily Brown paints, her world starts to change. What do you think that means? That means that she has an imagination. The sunlight turns to stars and Lily begins flying around them. All the universe is one big colorful splash. The stars circle the planets in Lily Brown's paintings. And sometimes they come down to earth to hang around sidewalk cafes and shine when the sun goes down. So that's an outdoor table with chairs. So that's the cafe and it will, those are the table and chairs outside the cafe. And these are stars. Wow, look at that. When Lily Brown paints, the trees that she walks past on her way to school wear hats and drink tea on cool days with other trees and shrubbery. They know Lily and bow to her. Oh, look at the trees with the hats. Look at that one. He has eyes, nose, mouth. Oh, these trees are wearing shoes. Look at that. When Lily Brown paints fruit at the corner market, it is striped and polka dotted. It speaks to people, then laughs out loud. When people put the fruit in bags to take home, the apples sing all the way there. Okay, so these are the apples and all kind of fruit. Brown's paintings, the path to the park becomes a wild animal living room with antelopes lounging and alligators on the phone. Lily always remembers to draw them a treat. In Lily Brown's paintings, softly blowing rose-colored winds bring voices from across the ocean to tell stories that she has never heard. Then she listens and paints with blues and orange to let the wind know she has heard them. And that's the wind there, look. Sometimes Lily herself walks around in her paintings or sails away through fields of red corn and purple painted skyscrapers. Those are the skyscrapers. That's her sailing.
In Lily Brown's paintings, the colors of people, places, and things change with her heart. People walk upside down and the buildings on streets dance with airplanes flying above and it's another world. paints all that she sees and feels her own way. She puts her world of color and light on anything she can find. It's magical. But at the end of the day, when Lily Brown is about to put her paints away, she remembers her mama's smile, her daddy's eyes, and the way her baby brother holds her hand before he goes to sleep. Oh, she drew a picture of her family. So cute. That's her baby brother holding her hand. It's their world again, and it's wondrous. That's the end of this book entitled Lily Brown's Paintings by Angela Johnson, and the illustrator is E.B. Lewis. And uh, you could probably find this book, boys and girls, at your local library or bookstore. Thank you for tuning in to Baby Wawa TV.